Hey everyone, Scott here from Simple Mechanic Advice. In today's video, we will be talking about how to fix the P1131 error. But first, what does P1131 mean? The P1131 error code represents a malfunction in the heater circuit of the upstream oxygen sensor or the first oxygen sensor in Bank 1's exhaust system. Oxygen sensors in your car ensure the engine maintains the right air to fuel ratio. When there is a fault, the powertrain control module detects it as the engine starts running lean, resulting in the error code. Here is what causes it. Dirty mass airflow sensor. The mass airflow sensor, MAF, measures how much air enters the engine. When it gets damaged or dirty, it results in many issues, including rough idling and an illuminated check engine light. Additionally, it could result in the P1131 error code. Clogged fuel filter. When the fuel filter is blocked with dirt and debris, there is no room for the fuel to get to its destination after filtration. Malfunctioned oxygen sensor. A faulty sensor is likely to give wrong readings that could cause the error to occur. Air leaks into the engine. When air leaks into the engine, it causes air to get into the combustion chamber. This results in more air in the air fuel mixture. Here are the solutions to try. Inspect the mass air flow sensor. Doing this can help determine whether the error results from a mass air flow sensor. Try the following. Put your engine in idle mode. Plug the scan tool into the OBD port and tap on the View Live Data button on the scan tool to see the MAF value. The correct reading should be between 2 and 7 grams per second and move to 15 to 25 grams per second when you step on the gas. However, while 2 to 7 grams per second at idle and 15 to 25 grams per second when accelerating are common ranges, these values can vary significantly by vehicle make and model. It is therefore advisable to consult the vehicle's service manual or manufacturer's specifications for the exact MAF sensor readings. When this is not the case, the MAF may need cleaning. Turn off the vehicle and put on gloves as you wait for the engine to cool down. Find the mass airflow sensor and disconnect it from the connector. Remove the sensor and clean it carefully using an MAF cleaner. Inspect the fuel filter. If you find out that a dirty mass airflow sensor is not the problem, Inspect the fuel filter. To do this, turn off the car, locate the fuel filter by consulting your owner's manual as its location varies depending on the model. Open the clamps in the fuel line, place a container below the fuel filter, and once you pull the hose on the filter, the fuel will pour out. Once all the fuel is out, replace the filter with a new one. Inspect the oxygen sensor. If you find out that a clogged fuel sensor is not the problem, inspect the oxygen sensor. Do this. Park the car on level ground and turn it off. Using a jack, lift the vehicle and have a jack stand to support it. Raise the car to the side where the faulty sensor is found. Take out the plug connected to the sensor cable and disconnect the electrical system from the oxygen sensor. Remove the sensor using a wrench and replace it with the new one. Connect the wiring of the sensor cable to the electrical system. Start the car to confirm the error is gone. Look out for air leaks. If the methods do not work, try watching out for any damages in the pipes that connect to the engine that could cause leaks. You are likely to hear air escaping from a certain part of the pipe, which will let you know there is a leak. If you identify a leak, consult your mechanic to replace the damaged pipes or cables. When all the methods fail, consult your mechanic who will diagnose and fix the problem. Thanks for watching.